Molinaro Connect in Redwood City, California, and this is our Demo Friday event. And this is some pretty exciting news. I'm standing here with Patrick Klinger, who is the, uh, Patrick, you're the program manager for ST Erickson? Yes, that's correct. And I'm here with Ricardo Salvetti. Ricardo, what is your title? I'm the developer platform lead at Lenaro. So I'm here with both ST Erickson and Lenaro. And earlier this week, we, it was a question whether we'd be able to do this incredible demo that we see in front of us over here. And it's XBMC running on Snowball. So we, our developers were able to get that introduced this week. So I'm going to let uh, Ricardo talk a little bit about how that came about. And I'm going to let Patrick know, uh, let you know why that's exciting news. So Ricardo? Yep, sure. Well, I can. I guess I can also point out a little bit more. Uh, the thing that we want to do is, uh, I mean, the platform is so powerful uh, in a way that it can play videos and, uh, and uh, uh, ARMD V7 A9 uh, uh, with Cortex A9 and such with dual core. And uh, something that would be really cool to have it is also make it available to play videos and so people could actually start using it at home. And, and XBMC is kind of the perfect solution at the moment. And uh, the thing that I want to try is uh, now that we have uh, the Mali drivers available for this specific board, we could start using uh, applications that are 3D accelerated. Uh, so what I did, uh, actually last night I, I, grew, uh, I got the latest XBMC release. This is the beta tree that was released yesterday for, for the Eden release. And uh, I did a, f a few fixes and uh, um, compiled it to be like, we still don't have video acceleration working. I think it's something that we can discuss a little bit more about. Uh, at least to be fully enabled with Neon and so we could at least play videos, uh, play 720p videos and have the full uh, UI uh, accelerated so people could easily use and grab and, uh, and something that we're also going to provide in uh, Linaro uh, uh, repositories and, and things like that. So. We can show, um, try to give it an overview. This is the basic uh, XBMC interface. So it is running pretty well. It's, uh, I think, 20 or 30 FPS per second. So you could already use uh, to play videos and music. And something that was actually quite nice that Lee uh, fixed it this week is the sound support on Snowball. So. You could already start playing uh, uh, videos and music and have kind of the whole experience from, a, uh, from kind of a set box uh, 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 environment that you would like to, for example, set up your home. And, uh, for example, this is a quick example running on a, a 720p video. It is still software decoding and we're using uh, uh, FFmpeg with Neon support. Uh, so it's it's pretty good actually for the for the first try that we are for the first build that we're doing for this board and uh, and now the next step that we're planning is, is actually completing the integration and making the, also the, the video decoding like uh, fully accelerated so you could also uh, reach uh, 1080p videos with it. Patrick, why is this so exciting for ST Erickson? I mean, this is exciting for ST Erickson and the community. Do not forget that. Because it, I mean, it, uh, I mean, it shows that we're moving forward. We're progressing on actually making the entire board fully accelerated, opening up new po possibilities uh, on this particular board. And uh, I mean, the snowball just showing this software uh, supported only, doing this this great job. I mean, it's uh, really exciting. So looking forward for the, I mean, when we roll really hardware accelerated, it's, I mean, it will be really, really nice. So what do you want to demo in Hong Kong? Yeah, in Hong Kong I hope that we will have this wonderful snowball board, board uh, fully 100% hardware accelerated, both on the Ubuntu track, we will have the XPMC, we will have OpenSUSE, and we will also have it on, of course, Ice Cream Sandwich and Android. So it's uh, Hong Kong I'm really looking forward, and I hope that we will blow the minds of uh, everyone in the community with this board. At least uh, I hope everyone will blow my mind. Uh, with the progress that will be done. So uh, I just want to also take the opportunity here to, I mean, this, this is a great uh, achievement that they have done this week. And uh, for me personally as well, because I will definitely get a couple of snowballs, put, one, uh, put them at home. And uh, I mean, they will remove my current media center solutions that I have at home. And uh, so snowball, uh, snowball is moving in with me now. 
uh, and hopefully all my neighbors. But anyway, I would like to really express my gratitude to Linaro uh, for the week here and especially to uh, Ricardo for the great job that he has done on, on, getting, on getting XBMC up and running on Snowball and also Lee Jones uh, from the Asterixon landing team for getting uh, audio uh, working really nicely uh, during this week as well. So uh, thank you everyone, uh, great job and I'm looking forward to uh, lots of interesting achievements uh, in the future. Thank you so much, Patrick, for Thanks. standing here and doing this interview. Thank you, Ricardo, and thank you, Lee.